What's good guys? Today bring you another video um compilation catching errors. So Java is a compiled programming language meaning the code we write in the dot java file is transpo transformed into bytecode by a compiler before it is executed by the Java virtual machine on your computer. A compiler is a program that translates human-friendly languages into other programming languages that computers can execute. So in the previous exercises have automatically compiled and run the files for you. All platform development environments can also compile and run files for you, but it's important to understand this aspect of Java development. So we'll do it ourselves. So the compiling process catches mistakes before the computers run our code. The Java compiler runs a series of checks while it transforms the code. Code that does not pass these checks will not be compiled. This exercise will use an interactive terminal Code Academy has a lesson on the command line if you'd like to learn more. So for example, with the file called plankton.java, we could compile it with the terminal command Java C and then your know, plankton.java. A, success, a successful compilation produces a doc class file, plankton.class, that we can execute uh, with the terminal command. An unsuccessful compilation produces a list of errors. No doc class file is made until the errors are co corrected. All right, let's practice compiling and executing a file by entering the commands in the terminal. So our text editor contains a broken program. Uh, so we can see how compilers help us to catch mistakes don't make any corrections so right here we can see that there's not a semicolon so this is all done on purpose in the terminal type the command java c compiling dot java enter and then you can see the error right here now click the check work button uh, to check your work and move on to the next. Okay. Do you see the error? The compiler is telling us that one of the print statements is missing a semicolon. In the terminal type ls and press enter. So ls enter. And then it prints printed out uh, compiling.java. ls is short for list and this command lists all the available files. There is only one file, compiling.java. We did not successfully co compile the file because of the error. Click on the button, the check with button, okay. And then add the missing semicolon um, into the text editor. Okay. We'll compile and execute this file in the next exercise. So this was compilation catching errors. Now the next uh, module is going to be creating executables. So compilation helped us catch an error. Now that we've corrected the file, let's work through a successful compilation. As a reminder, we can use we can compile a .java file from the terminal. Uh, with the command java uh, c uh, the name of the file dot java if the file compiles successfully this command produces an executable class so file name dot class executable means we can run this program from the terminal we run the executable with the command Note that if we leave the dot class file part of the file name right here, you leave off 
the doc class right here. Here is a full compilation cycle as an example. We have one file, welcome.java, compile with the command, and then the terminal shows no errors, which indicates a successful compilation. Now we have two files, welcome.java and welcome.class. We can execute the uh, compile class with the command java welcome and the following is printed all right so let's see run the ls command okay um in the command to see the uncompiled java file okay press the check work okay now compile the file from the terminal and press check work so java c and then remember we have the uh, we have compiling compiling dot java did that not work compiling dot java okay yeah, and then enter ls again to see it. Okay, there we go. Now we have the uh, compiling dot class file as well. Oh, enter ls again. Okay. Oh, it says run the executable file. So we do Java and then just compiling and then, and then everything here runs boom and done all right so that is going to end it um, in the next video i'll do the java review but until then have a great day